Let's now try Mongo Restore in action. Attached to this lesson, you will find file called mongorestore.txt. Here you will find some templates that use Mongo Restore command. So this one will restore data from the dump folder to the remote server. This one will perform same action but for local MongoDB server. In this case, you can specify using dir option certain directory where dump is located. Here it is. And in the last option, you can restore data from the archive. Here you need to use archive option and jzip option. But before moving on, I will show you contents of the backup that was created using mongodump utility. I have opened my DB folder here, and here you see bison files, like this, so cursor.bison, first.bison, and so on. Those bison files represent certain collections. Along with bison files, dump contains metadata.json files. Those files contain information about indexes. For example, cursor collection has index by underscore id. It is default index. Ok, now I will try to restore data from this dump. This dump is located on the desktop in the dump folder and it contains just one mydb database. Let's first delete this database on the mongodb server. I will do this using robo3t. So just locate mydb, right button click and drop database. So fingers crossed. Drop mydb database, yes. So now mydb is dropped. Let's go back to the notepad and here I have prepared command that will restore data from the dump folder and it will restore data to the remote MongoDB server. So just copy this command, go to the terminal and in the terminal, I am on the desktop here, just paste this command, enter. And you will see process of the restore. And finally you will see done, it means that restore was completed. Let's go back to the robots 3 team and here refresh view. And you will see MyDB here with all collections, cursor, first, new persons and so on. Let's open for example persons collection. And you see that collection was restored successfully. Ok, let's now try to restore from the archive. Let's again drop this database, drop database, yes. And in the notepad, well, let's close this tab. And in the notepad, I will copy second command that will restore data from the archive. Archive name is dump.jz and it is located on the desktop. So let's copy this command, go back to the terminal and let's clear it and paste this command. Enter. And same process and finally done. Ok, let's go back to the robots 3 team, refresh view here and again mydb was successfully restored with all collections in place. Ok, let's go on and next talk about some utilities that help you to monitor MongoDB server performance. See you shortly.